An accused serial burglar is behind bars in Columbus tonight after police claim he ripped off several businesses last week. This evening, Fox 59's Jesse Wells explains how the suspect got caught. The crime spree came to an end when a police canine tracked the suspect down to an apartment building here on this street. In all, police believe the suspect broke into five businesses in five days. At this Columbus liquor store, then at this Mexican restaurant, as well as three other nearby businesses, Columbus police say for five nights in a row, someone broke into stores in nearly the same way. It was very similar where a rock was thrown either through a glass window or, or a glass door of a business. Uh, the suspect was in and out in a very short amount of time. Police claim the break in at this restaurant was the last in the series of crimes. Officers on patrol just minutes earlier allegedly spotted Jerron McDonald walking in the area, then realized the suspect was caught on camera during the burglary that same night. When the officers reviewed the security footage, they observed the man that the officers were out with just prior to that. After a police canine helped track down the suspect to South Cherry Street, police searched McDonald's apartment and found a large amount of cash and lottery tickets stolen in some of the incidents. Lieutenant Harris hopes McDonald's arrest gives business owners in Columbus some peace of mind. Absolutely, thinking, oh, this is my business next, or, you know, they can have some relief that, yeah, this person uh, is behind bars. Like I said, I know the business owners are very appreciative of, uh, you know, this case being, being brought to a close. Finally, the suspect is being held in the Bartholomew County Jail on preliminary charges of burglary, possession of stolen property, and criminal mischief. Additional charges could also be filed. Jesse Wells, Fox 59 News.